Hey, art friends, welcome back to another Let's Draw, uh, live Let's Draw. Yeah. Are you ready to draw? Yeah. Do you hope our art friends are ready to draw too? Yeah. Yes. You haven't done one in a while, have you? Yeah. You're, you're excited? Yeah. <laughs> uh oh, we got our volume turned up. We're going to have to turn our volume down on our computer too. It's a little quiet. Let's do that. There we go. Sorry, I messed up. <laughs> well, what are we drawing today? Did you uh, forget? Yeah. What are we drawing? Um. Uh, think, sandwich. Think, a sandwich. Yeah, we're going to draw a sandwich. We hope you guys are going to follow along with us. Yesterday, what did we draw with Hadley? A toaster. A toaster. A funny toaster and some funny toast. Today, we're going to draw a funny sandwich. <laughs> but before we do that, we got to spotlight one of our awesome art friends, don't we? Yeah. And look at that. They did it awesome. Yeah. The challenge was to finish, by finish your art by drawing your counter, your kitchen counter. And they did awesome. I can't believe how many things they drew on their drawing. Yeah. They've got the counter, they've got the cupboards, they got even the little plug that's plugging the toaster in. <laughs> and they've got the, there's a little person over here spreading jelly on some toast and it looks like it's screaming because <laughs> it's gonna, somebody's gonna eat. <laughs> And there's even butter and a knife. Uh, I love it. They did such a great job on their challenge. In fact, all of our art friends did amazing on the challenge. It was really cool to check out all of their drawings. Yeah. They, there were some really cute ones and some funny ones. Yeah. <laughs> what was your, what's your favorite part on this drawing? Probably the peanut butter the and the peanut, jelly. You like the peanut butter and the jelly? Yeah. I like the peanut or butter the and the jelly. Waffle. Or the waffle. Yeah, it looks it's like a waffle, huh? Right by the toaster, it says yum. And then it, the, I think it's a waffle and it's saying, no, don't eat me. <laughs> all right. Well, we hope you guys are excited. You got your art supplies already. We want to give a big shout out to everybody that's participating in our live chat. You want to shout them out? Say hi. Say hi. hi. <laughs> and we're going to try to answer a lot of your questions and comments and give you shout outs during the lesson too. Okay, dude. What do they need for this lesson? Marker? Over here. Marker. Marker. Paper, paper, and pencil, and some colorings. Coloring. Yeah, something to color with. Now, if we ever go too fast, remind our art friends what were you eating the colorings? <laughs> what can they do if we go too fast? Pause the video. Yeah, pause the video, even though this is live. Now, also, you got your marker ready? <laughs> no. You're ready? Now you do. <laughs> okay. Now we're first going to start by drawing the top of our sandwich. And also, we're gonna draw. We're gonna draw it funny too. We're gonna draw a cartoon version. So we're first gonna start by drawing an upside down. Watch this. It's a really wide U. We're gonna go up like this, across. We're drawing a sub sandwich, or a foot long sandwich, like sub foot. sub foot long subway. Foot, sub subway. Subway. <laughs> Hey, and we're going to give some of you guys shout outs too. We're going to try to keep an eye on the live chat while we're doing the lesson. But while we're coloring, it'll be a little easier to, to shout you guys out. So Lori Merset says, hi, Mrs. Hubs. She's actually not with us right now. She She's not uh, in this one. Maybe the next one, Mrs. Hubs. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you ready for the next step? Yeah. We're going to draw the bottom of our piece of bread. So this is the top piece of bread. We're going to connect... We're going to draw a line that goes all the way over and connects to the other side. Yeah. Sarah Bensaid, ben, Bensaid says, please shout me out. And Hi. let's see, Tara says, can you, can you do a YouTube logo video? That would be really cool to draw the YouTube logo. And Aiden Pickle says, I love them. We love you too, Aiden. And oh, somebody just asked for an alligator. Mr. Pigeon, Mr. Pigeon says, are you making funny faces? <laughs> asked us to draw uh, an allig alligator. That would be way cool. Oh, and Valerie asks us, what are the colored pencils that we're using? We're using uh, Prismacolor colored pencils, but you can use whatever color, whatever brand you want. And I also have links below this video where you can head over to Amazon and purchase the same colored pencils. Am I talking too much? No. <laughs> Are you making fun of me? No. Okay. <laughs> what should we draw next on our bread? We're going to draw it down. We're drawing the top layer first, then we're going to draw the next layer. Let's draw some lettuce. Do you yeah. like lettuce? We just got a donation. Did we get a donation and I missed it? Yep. You know what? And I think I noticed that we got some donations while before we even started. And I'll have to look. Okay, let's draw, let's draw the lettuce and then I'll see what the donation was. I can check it. So I'm going to draw a wavy line like this. I'm going to draw it all the way over to the middle. Then I'm going to draw another one right next to it. 
And then I'm going to draw another one next to that one for the very far right side. Okay, let me see if I can find the donation. This is so cool. Thank you guys so much. Uh, I got to scroll down. Where's where's it at? Where's it at? Here we go. <laughs> we did. Thank you so much. Noobs are out. They uh, donated 99 cents. Thank you. Oh, and also Dalton said, hey, I've been watching you for a while now. They donated $2. I think that was before the stream even started. And Leandro uh, donated, you're the best drawers. And they said, uh, donated $1.99. Thank you guys so much for your donations. It means a lot. You got your lettuce done? Almost. Almost? Almost. Keep going. <laughs> I'm going to check out the comments a little bit more. <laughs> there we go. This is awesome. Crafty Pro says, this is awesome. Thank you so much. Uh, Cassandra says, OMG, is this still going? Yes, we're live right now. Yeah, you didn't miss it. If you, if you did just join us, though, and you haven't started your drawing yet, you can pause the video, start it over after you get your supplies ready. Let's draw tomatoes next, mm -hmm. should we? Okay, we're going to draw, we're gonna draw uh, ovals, not ovals, uh, let's see, U-shapes like this. So I'm gonna, we're only drawing part of it because it's overlapping. It's underneath our lettuce. Mm -hmm. Then I'm going to draw, watch this, we're going to draw another one right below it. Yeah, you did a great tomato. And we're going to draw another one right, look at this, right below it. Like that. So it's super skinny. Super skinny. That's the side of our tomato. And then I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to repeat that same step right next to it. Watch this. We're going to do another one right next to it. So we can layer our tomatoes. I'm going to draw a bunch. Usually when you go to Subway or Subway, you get uh, <laughs> lots of tomatoes. So I'm going to do a whole line of them. Look at that. Oh, and I like it. So you can overlap them too if you want, but go all the way across your sandwich. Okay. Is that cool? Mm -hmm. While you're doing that, I'm going to answer some more comments. <laughs> Michaela, let's see, Michaela West says, can I get a shout out? And Flower123 says, it's my birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Uh, Happy Lake, birthday. Lake Shay, Shia says, shout out. Uh, Kendall says, hi, I love you all. We love you too. And Monkey, Le are you singing a happy birthday song? <laughs> and Daniel, Daniel Snodderly says, shout out. And uh, Bag Studios, B-A-G Studios says, can I get a shout out? And Lucy Thorne wants us to draw a football player. We, we should draw a football player. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, you got your tomatoes? Let's yep. do the next layer. We're going to do cheese. Okay, so the cheese, we're going to draw uh, V shapes. So there's a V. We're going to draw a sideways V like this. And then I'm going to draw another sideways V. It looks like a chip. Sharp cheese. And we're drawing sharp cheese. It looks like a chip cheese. <laughs> chip. Looks like a chip. Chip cheese. <laughs> so I'm going to go all the way across, and you can layer. So you can even add. A second layer of cheese if you want. I'm gonna I, I always ask for extra cheese on my Subway sandwich or <laughs> my foot long. We never even go to Subway that much. Not as much. Yeah, we don't go as much. <laughs> uh. We just make sandwiches at home. So yeah. keep going, keep adding little V's that go all the way across your sandwich. Now next week I also want to mention that uh, Monday and Tuesday and Wednesday we won't be posting of a, list, a lesson on Monday through Wednesday because of the holiday. Fourth of July is coming up and we're going to do a bunch of family stuff, right? And fireworks. And fireworks. We're going to do fireworks and eat lots of good food. And <laughs> we're going to spend a lot of time with family. So Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, we're going to take off. But then we'll be back on Thursday, which is the 5th, July yeah. 5th. Okay, what should we draw next? What's our sandwich missing? It needs, it's got cheese, vegetables, and one of the most important parts... Meat. Fry sauce. Fry sauce. Maybe. Let's draw some meat. <laughs> we like fry sauce, don't we? Yeah. And then, so I'm just going to, the meat's going to look a little bit like salad, but when we color it brown, it won't look like salad. So I'm going to draw a wavy line for this layer. And you guys could add extra stuff, too. You could use your imagination to add other things. Maybe you like olives or pickles or what else do you like on your Subway sandwich? Um, I forgot everything. <laughs> You really just like peanut butter and jelly. Kevin Kevin asked for a shout out. Uh, Ollie's Rob, Roblox game says, can you draw a hammerhead shark? 
We, we actually have drawn a hammerhead shark. It was a while ago. We didn't color it, but you can search on our channel to find it. Uh, <laughs> shout out, please. I love your channel. That's from Sparkle Turtle. Thank you, Sparkle, for the nice comment. And Aiden Pickle says, I love them. We love you, too. You got your meat on there? Yeah. Got your beef? Okay, let's draw the last the last part of our sandwich is the bottom part of the bread. So we're just gonna, we're gonna repeat the same shape, but upside down. So we're gonna start here. We're gonna go all the way across the bottom like this and then connect over to the other side for the last piece of bread. Adam Dab wants a shout out and Libby Phillips says it's my birthday too. Do you want to say happy birthday to Libby? No, you don't wait. To you. <laughs> Yeah, Zach Connor says you're the best and cool. Can you draw Shimba? Oh, Webkins asked us if we could draw Simba. Do you know who Simba is? No. From Lion King. All right, what's our what's our sandwich missing? Um. Up here, something on top. Seeds. Seeds. We could draw seeds. We could draw funny face. Funny face. Yeah. <laughs> Every time. I'm going to draw two circles. I'm going to try and figure out a different mouth to draw than what I've drawn on the last ones. And I'm trying, I'm stuck. I'm not sure what I'm going to draw. So I'm going to draw a smaller circle inside for the highlight so the eyes look shiny. Color in the big circle. If you leave it like this, it kind of looks like his mouth, doesn't it? Like his mouth has got all the food in oh, there. Oh, yeah. And then I'm going to draw, let's see, I'm going to draw little wiggly lines here on the side. Maybe he's nervous. <laughs> And then I'm just gonna, yeah, I'm just gonna draw a smile. Just a happy is a happy foot long. <laughs> <laughs> and actually, if you want, sometimes on the top of the bread, there's little uh, they make little marks on top of the bread. So I'm gonna add little V's for the top, the very top of the bread. Oh, uh, Ferris says, please draw a national animal of Pakistan. I don't even know what the national animal is. Maybe you could help uh, uh, leave a comment and let me know what that national animal is. Um, <laughs> Michaela wants you to sing happy birthday song to me. Happy birthday. <laughs> no, don't. <no. laughs> well, just say happy birthday. Happy say. birthday. Michaela. Mich yeah, Michaela. <laughs> We'll be here all day if we're singing a happy birthday to every single person that has a birthday. Yeah. Hey, you did a great job on your sandwich, buddy. Did you Did you have fun? Yeah. Now, we're not completely done, are we? Yeah. What do we still need to do to our sandwich to finish it? Color it. Yeah, we need to color our sandwiches. And we're going to use our color pencils, our Prismacolor. But you guys could use oil pastels. You could use markers. Anything you want, really. You don't have to use color pencils. Now, I'm going to use this light brown, this color to color our bread. And then I'm also going to use a darker brown to add some shading. This color. Oh, this like, color. Yeah. This is actually, uh, it's called beige. And I'm going to use this to color our our uh, bread. And then we're going to try to do some more shout outs and also answer a few more comments. Now, I want to know what you guys, if you guys have any big plans for the 4th of July. We're going to do family stuff. That's from that book. <laughs> what? That thing is from a book. Oh, the pigeon. Yeah, yeah Mr. Pigeon. pigeon. That's from the pigeon book, huh? Mm -hmm. He saw the, the channel icon, Mr. Pigeon. Oh, we love that book, don't we? Yeah. Can you draw a building, Elsa asked. And Tiffany Hahn wants a shout out. Also, Miss Anna Eve Rick wants a shout out. And Zach Connor says, I'm subscribed. Thank you so much, Zach Connor. Now, if you guys are watching this actually later, so we're doing it live right now, but we're going to post this video on our channel so you guys can re-watch it later. So if you're watching this later, <laughs> Be sure to subscribe to our channel and turn on notifications so that you don't miss our next live stream, our next live drive, uh, draw, draw along. So we love doing this, don't we, Austin? Yeah. We love talking to our art friends live. Mm -hmm. All right. What are you most excited about for 4th of July, food or fireworks? Um, mostly food. Um, fireworks. Fireworks? You used to be kind of scared of them, though. Yeah. Are you still Happy, scared of them? No, but Happy's more scared. Dude. She's more scared? She is a little scared, huh? She was super scared when she was little. We had to keep her inside the house when we were lighting off fireworks. Yeah. Oh, the animal name is uh, Mark uh, Markar from... Uh, oh, that's cool. 
I'll have to look that up. I'm, I don't even know what animal that is. I'll have to check it out. Do you want to sharpen? You need to sharpen? You don't need to sharpen. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Gets the wood okay, all right, all right. It's okay. I'll sharpen it anytime you need. Okay. <laughs> draw Angela. No, not now. Yeah. <laughs> Angela says, draw the FIFA uh, logo. That would be way cool. What do you I do love you getting want? your guys' requests. Fireworks are my favorite. Adam Dab says, fireworks are my favorite. We got to do some of those fireworks that actually go up into the sky and then explode. Those ones are cool. Mm -hmm. Yeah. What is that? Something fall? Oh, two markers. Go. Two markers. <laughs> I love your little face, man. You turned out <laughs> awesome. Now, our art friends, we could challenge them to do something else with their drawing. What do you think? They, they could draw uh, more sandwiches. They could draw kind of like the toast. You could do the same thing. Yeah. But I have a different challenge that we're going to give our art friends at the very end. Okay? Yeah. I've already thought of it. I know what it's going to be. Because we're going to be on break, I want to give them a big, a big challenge to post something on Instagram. <laughs> oh, uh, Crafts and uh, DIYs Queen says you should do more watercolor tutorials. We should. I love doing watercolor tutorials. One of the reasons why we haven't done as many is because it, they just take a lot longer to create. They're a lot, there's a lot more involved. You want me to sharpen it again? <laughs> I pushed so hard. Hard. Elena Elena Doyle says I want to shout out you did. Daniel Snorter, Snodderly says you are my favorite YouTube thank you <laughs> try North Korea flag wow we should do more flags we should draw more flags have you drawn with chalk we haven't done uh, actually we have we've done one I was thinking if I still had it. Uh, we did a sunflower with chalk, with pastels, and with uh, chalk pastels, not the oil pastels, and that was a lot of fun. It was really cool. We should do more. Can you draw a funny guy? Yay, flags. Aiden Pickle wants flags. Oscar Vlog says, you're the bomb. Miss <laughs> Miss uh, Brumlow says, stitch and angel to draw. And Libby Phillips says it's her birthday, too. Happy birthday. <laughs> Happy birthday. We're... I was so close for singing. <laughs> you were going to sing, I know. Happy birthday. <laughs> Let me sweep your drawing. There we go. Dude, your sandwich is looking really cool. It's looking super tasty. I'm going to switch to green, and I'm going to start coloring my lettuce. And um, then I'm going to switch to red. We'll do the tomatoes. You guys could add every, you know, other vegetables like olives. And what else could they add? What else do you like? What's your favorite kind of sandwich, Austin? Do you like turkey, roast beef, ham, peanut butter and jelly, chicken, meatballs? Mm. <laughs> Got you stumped. <laughs> Draw a banana because I love bananas. That's from the I'm Banana channel. That's what I like, honestly. Bananas? Like bananas. Peanut butter and bananas. I love peanut butter and banana sandwiches. Yep. Those are way good. Now, we actually have drawn a banana. You could go over to our channel and search it, and you'll be able to find a funny banana. That was a really funny one, actually. I think Hadley did that one. All right, now I'm going to switch to red. I'm going to start coloring my tomatoes. This is a big sandwich. It's a mm -hmm. foot long. Mine doesn't even really look like a foot long. Yeah. Do you know where my favorite sandwich place is, though? What? It's not Subway. It's... JCW's. Well, I like no, JCW's too. <laughs> in and out? You hate. What? No, I like. <laughs> no, I don't. I like. Uh, um, uh, I totally forgot. Pop bellies. I like pop bellies. You like pop bellies too, don't you? Yeah. Pop belly sandwich. Oh. Uh, they have a really good Oreo shake. That's why I like going there. And they got really good pickles. Let me sweep Wait. your drawing. Yeah, they do have pickles. Yeah, Olivia they have really big pickles. Olive loved those. Olivia loves pickles, and doesn't she? Yes. Yes. <laughs> it takes long to color something big. That's from Cassandra Valdez. It does. Sometimes it does take a long time to color, but are you having fun? Yeah. It's fun to color. I think it's coloring is like my favorite thing. And actually, when we do the pre-recordings, when we just record, we don't do it live. 
sometimes I think it's fun because me and you have fun yeah. uh, coloring, but then we fast forward it and you guys don't get to see the how much fun we have while we're coloring it. Yeah. Yeah. But that's but I think that's why you need a friend. That's why you should always have a friend when you're when you're doing art. And a friend could be a parent, it could be your Another next door kid? neighbor, it could be a brother and sister, it could be a cousin. Like the pirate video. Yeah. When we draw, draw it at school. Yeah. We, you guys all drew together, didn't you? Mm -hmm. And also, we count as your friends. So I think when you're coloring something big, and it might take like a long time, it's still a blast. It's still way fun because you're coloring, you're doing art with your friends. Mm -hmm. All right, now I'm going to switch to my beef color, brown. Where's the beef? Beef. Beef and cheese. Beef and cheese. Beef and cheddar. <laughs> then I'm also going to add some shading. Friends, drawing with friends is always is always my favorite and you guys are my friends. Did you, you know that? smear over eye. Uh, oh no. <laughs> I'm gonna draw a goat. Uh, I am left-handed. That's from Foxy Fan. I think left-hand artists are awesome. Mm -hmm. They're super cool. Um Cheryl says, please shout out to my little girl, Izzy Bullock, as she's a huge fan. Thank you, Cheryl. Say, shout out to Izzy. Say, hi, Izzy. Hi, Izzy. Yeah. She's drawing with us. And can you draw more Fortnite? That's from Bodie Dunn. Um, yeah, we're going to draw more Fortnite. Uh, Jack and I are working on the next one. We're going to try and figure out which one we want to draw next. Um, I think it's going to be that carbide guy. Car and we're also planning to draw more... Uh, Incredibles. Yeah. Don't wait. worry if you've been wondering when we're going to draw more Incredibles. We will. I promise. He went and saw the movie all by himself. Yes, they know. I've told them. Oh. <laughs> You're still bitter about it. I can tell. But I'm going to add a little shade. I'm still mad at you. I know you are. No. I'm sorry. I apologize. <laughs> I feel really bad. I'll make it up to you. I promise. I do know you went and watched it. I <laughs> know. I kind of kept it a secret. I went because I thought it's long, and sometimes you don't like seeing long movies, right? I like seeing. You long still wanted to movies. go. I know, I know. Halfway through the movie, you're like, "Can I have more popcorn?" And then I gotta go get more popcorn because you're bored. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm gonna add a little shading underneath to make my my bread look more 3D. So I just added a dark layer. I used my dark brown, and I started really dark on the edges like this, and then got lighter towards the middle. So sometimes, it, sometimes I, I use black for the shading, but sometimes black is too dark. So if you just use a darker color of the same, so just a darker version of the same color, it works better. So we use light brown for the bread, and I'm using a dark brown to add the shading. If I use black, it might be too dark. And you're doing great! Look at that, you're shading! I love it. I'm also going to color the spikes in here a little bit darker. And let's see if we can answer a few more comments because we're actually almost done. And we're going to miss you guys while we're on break next week. Oh, Jules says, I'm left-handed too. Please draw a baby hippo. Squishy Forever says, I broke my wrist. That doesn't sound good. You got to, if you broke your wrist, you should try drawing with the other hand. Yeah. Yeah, you should practice. But that doesn't feel good. Mm-hmm. How do you get the overhead view of your drawing? Elizabeth asked how we get this view right here where we're recording our drawing. It's just the second camera and we've got it mounted to the ceiling. It's aimed down. That's all, nothing too complicated. <laughs> there we go, I'm almost done. You know what, we could add more. I could use a dark green. Let's do that. I'm gonna use dark green and I'm gonna add a little shadow on the lettuce too. Right here, I'm gonna add shadows so that it looks like it's more 3d look at that oh that looks cool michaela west just asked if we could draw omega we actually have we just drew omega this week so be sure to check that out on our channel it was a way fun lesson gracie mcfall wants a shout out and ria ria jayanti jayanti ask for a penguin and Hadley's been dying to draw the blue penguin, hasn't she? Mm -hmm. Which I think is the smallest penguin that 
that's living. Oh, look at your shading, dude. Your shading looks really cool. Do you want to color in the little spikes? Okay. And then we're actually, I think we're all finished. We could add darker. I'm going to use that same brown. I'm going to add a little shadow on the tomatoes also. Maybe I'll use uh, black on the tomatoes. Yeah. Let me see. I'm going to switch to black. The brown still it works, but it's not as dark. So we can go a little bit darker if you want for dark shadow on the tomatoes and make it look really 3D. Is there another black one? You want another black? You can use that one. And then I'll switch to this one. And survival item survival says I'm new to your channel. I drew the tools for Father's Day. That's way cool. And welcome to our channel. I'm so glad you found us. We love drawing and we love meeting new art friends all over the world. So it's cool to, that you found us. I hope your dad, I'm sure he loved the, the uh, tools that you drew for him for Father's Day. I bet it turned out really cool. And Rena Ren, Renee Johnston says, you rock. <laughs> oh, and LOL Surprise says, my cat died. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. I laugh, but I really didn't mean to. If <laughs> I'm so sorry that you can't die. Uh, let's see. My <laughs> Rick Piper says, realistic Arctic fox, please. Oh, my gosh. That would be cool. We drew a cartoon uh, Arctic fox. It turned out awesome. It was really cool. Arctic, Arctic. I feel so bad. We love, we, we, have, we had pets um, a while ago, and one of them passed away. One of them died. We came home and it Kevin. was the Kevin. Yeah. He broke his leg. Yeah. And it, we, we couldn't save him and we lost him and we felt so bad, huh? Mm -hmm. That was really sad. Mm -hmm. Are you okay? Yeah. <laughs> All right. We did it. We finished our sandwiches, man. It turned out really cool. I love how yours turned out. Now, you guys remember at home, it's okay if your drawings look different. Our drawings look different, right? Yeah. Hey, let me get a little sweeper and sweep you again. <laughs> all right well let's see let's see a few more comments and then uh let's see draw a dalmatian beanie boo says draw a dalmatian Alyssa says we should do vlogs draw the world cup <laughs> shout out emily says can i have a shout out and clyde clyde says shout out and then uh i thought i saw a question in here where did it go it's so hard to check these out Oh, you should draw a, Lily Ann says you should draw a Polaroid camera with a picture. I love Polaroid cameras. That would be way fun. We'll do that one. Would that be fun? You know what the Polaroid is? We saw it at Target. They're the big cameras. And then when you take a picture, it comes out the front. Oh. Dude. And you actually have a picture. It's not a digital picture. <laughs> All right, dude. Did you have fun drawing your sandwich? Yeah. Well, we're not completely done, are we? Yeah. We need to challenge our art friends. Now, you guys can finish this drawing by adding a background, but I want to give you a different challenge, a super challenge. Since we're going to be on break next week during the 4th of July, I want to challenge you guys to draw something epic about 4th of July. It could be anything. You could draw fireworks. You could draw your favorite thing to do on the 4th of July. You could draw a an firework exploding. Yeah, you could draw it exploded. You could draw an eagle. You could draw the American flag, anything you want, something that has to do with the um, with uh, the 4th of July, Independence Day. And then when we come back on Thursday, we're going to pick a few more spotlights. We're not going to do one. We'll do a couple because we want to show off a bunch of our art friends' art. We want to see how cool it turned out. Yeah. Sound awesome? You going to help me pick them out? Yeah. All right. You promise? Yeah. <laughs> All right. Well, we hope you guys have an awesome weekend. We hope you had a lot of fun drawing with us live today. We want to give one more shout out to everybody that participated in our live chat. We hope you guys had fun following along with us. Be sure to ask your parents when you're all done with the challenge. I almost forgot to tell them. Ask your parents to post a photo of your 4th of July epic challenge on Instagram. Tag it, tag us in it, and also use the hashtag AFKH challenge. Challenge AFKH challenge that helps us be able to keep all the photos together, and so we can find it easy. And then we'll pick three or four spotlight artists in our next lesson, which will be on Thursday, July fifth. <laughs> you want to say goodbye to our friends? Bye. We love John with you, and we'll see you later, our friends. Goodbye.